African elephants are the largest land mammals on the planet. Not only that, the elephants also have the heaviest brains of all land animals. They can weigh up to 11 pounds. Elephants are eating machines. They can eat between 200 to 600 pounds of food a day. Baby elephants sometimes suck on their trunks, just like baby humans suck on their thumbs. Elephants can hear calls from other elephants through the ground with their feet. Pretty cool, huh? Today on Ever Wonder, we're at Calkins Creamery, a dairy farm that makes cheese. Emily and Maggie are going to show us their process. There are many different types of cheese, but the first step is always milking the cow. The milk is stirred in the pasteurizer, which heats up and kills off bacteria that naturally lives in the milk. Starter cultures and rennet are added, which helps to make the milk curd and stick together. After stirring and resting, the cheese becomes wobbly, which means it's almost ready. After it becomes more solid, they divide the cheese up into small squares. The extra liquid from the cheese, called whey, is drained out and the cheese is stirred again. After it's completely drained, it's divided and then hooped, which is when they put it in different containers. It looks like popcorn. This cheese is wrapped up in a cheesecloth and then pressed, which gets rid of the excess moisture and forms the shape of the cheese. This other cheese is being poured into molding containers and is then flipped several times. Cheese can also be dipped in wax, left to grow mold around it, or soaked in a brine for more flavor. Next time you're eating a delicious cheese curd, be sure to thank your local cow. Knock, knock. Who's there? Annie. Annie who? Anyone home? <laughs> <laughs> I get it, anyone home. It's like Annie sounds like anyone, so like anyone home. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? Beth. Beth who? The best time ever. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? Diane. Diane who? I'm dying to meet you. I'm dying to meet you too. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? Maya. Maya who? Will you be my best friend? Sure! Hey, Keen. Knock, knock. Who's there? Stacy. Stacy who? Stay seated until the bus stops. That is <laughs> hilarious. <laughs> Brain play. What silly sock design could you create? Polka dots with zigzags and stripes. I would put a really big smiley face like on the front and then on the back, there would be lots and lots of stars. Little tiny animals glued to it. <laughs> That'd be pretty weird. You could have a teddy bear on top of your, sh your sock. That would be funny. <laughs> you couldn't put your shoe on, but it would be funny. <laughs> make it! Today we're going to make a birthday ring toss game. What we have to do is we throw the rings, onto the screws and get points, and then you add up all the points. And the materials are scissors, paper, craft foam, glue, paint, markers, decorations, bamboo skewers, and a styrofoam cylinder. First, paint the plate yellow, and we'll paint the cylinder blue. So let's pass out the newspapers so, so we, we don't, don't get, get the, the table, table messy. Let's do this thing. This is fun. I think crafts are always fun. Yeah. Let's do the sides too. Okay.
I think we're done painting. Yeah. You should let it dry now. Totally. Yeah. I think okay. we should use ribbon on the cake. Here we go. Here. Yep. Okay. We can take the pup paint and add dots. Like wow, that's a great idea. Yeah. What do you think about your design? I think mine is cool. I think uh, this looks really cool. I made a star. <laughs> wow. And I'll make a moon on the opposite side. Hey, we have some stickers. We, we have to put some on the sides. There. The stickers match the star on top of the cake. Oh, yeah. I know. And there we go. Yay. We'll make shapes like flames onto the paper. Then we'll cut them out. We traced our flame on the paper, but we fold it in half because we need two of the same size. And having two means you get to have have a flame on both sides. Now let's number so, them. I'll be one and two. Okay. To make a ring, we need to take a piece of craft foam, and then we cut a circle on the outside of it and cut a circle in the middle of it, and you'll get a ring. It looks like this. Let's play. Lawson, you can go first. Okay, I'm going for the five. Let's see it, Lawson. Yeah! Yes. Five points for Lawson. Ten points for Lawson. Snowflakes form when water vapor freezes high up in the atmosphere. Every snowflake is made up of about 200 tiny ice crystals. Snowflakes can fall from the sky at three or four miles per hour. All snowflakes form into a hexagon, a shape with six sides. The largest snowflake ever recorded was 15 inches across. Pretty cool, huh? Brain play. What would it be like if your brain picked up TV channels? I think I think it would feel like tingly up in my head because there, like you'd be picking up like wave like like TV waves and stuff. I'd be watching all day. It would be kind of weird because I wouldn't want to watch a certain channel, but it would pick it up anyway. I would watch movies all day long. <laughs> I wouldn't be able to focus because I'd be like too entertained with like the channels going around in my head. It'd be hard to study in school because you'd be watching TV and it'd be a mess in your brain because you'd have, you'd have to be doing something and then you would be like watching TV. Like if you're trying to do chores, your mother would be like, come on, do your chores. She'd be like. Can you figure out who I am? I create worlds with castles and dungeons, faraway universes, battlefields, and more. But my background is in engineering, design, and art. I take characters and ideas and design how to tell their story. Most of my work is done on a computer. My work can be found on smartphones, tablets, computers, and consoles. Who am I? A video game designer. Where do cows go on vacation? I don't know where. New York City. And sometimes New Jersey. You got that right. What did the grape say when the elephant stepped on him? Nothing. He just let out a little wine. Get it? Because wine, people drink wine, and another wine is like, eh. Where do funny frogs sit? Silly pads. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Hey Alyssa, what? What's a skunk's favorite sandwich? I don't know. Peanut butter and smelly. <laughs> what do you call an elephant in a phone booth? Stuck. Oh. 